One view, everyone knows the rules. I get to look at an ad one time and see if it's good branding, a good direct response, or just a crappy ad, and I'm specifically looking for Connect TV. So let's see what we have today. So we have Burlington's. I think we've all heard of them, so let's check out their ad. Her outfit is great, but I saw it at the department store for $96. I got one just like that for $38 at Burlington. And this outfit for my husband and play clothes for the twins. <laughs> I saved so much, I got backups. Nice. Burlington, brag about it. It's a good ad. Um, I think that, I think what they've touched on, and I really like how they've used the logo or the name. Rather than what we always talk about is let's use the name or the logo throughout, which is, which is important. The importance is at any point in time when I look up, I can tell who you are, right? If I haven't heard of you before, I can see the name, I can type it. I know I have a small window of time, 15 or 30 seconds, to get your name and understand who you are and write your name down. Now, Burlington has the luxury that you've probably heard of them before, that SEO is gonna be on point. If you were comparing that to a company that maybe is less well-known, where you're trying to really introduce them, then you really want that logo throughout. But I think they do it a great way of, while talking about the unique selling points, the name popped up with the 65% discount stuff. I thought that was really smart. Uh, and so I think there's a really nice way of doing it. They also use the name a couple of times. So you had that verbal element as well as the visual. And I think they did a great job there. Uh, it's definitely a professional asset. Uh, they touch on the unique selling points really nicely at the low price. Um, the two areas that I really think that they could just tweak, I think there needs to be something better to make me pay attention. Um, the cost savings is the unique selling point, but it's not why I necessarily pay attention to the asset. And I think we need to be really careful there is what makes me lift my head up and pay attention to the TV screen. So that's number one that I think they could do a slightly better job on. And the end card, it's a good end card, but I think that, you know, again, if it's a DR campaign, I'm all about visit us online, visit us in store, and making it very much like I'm telling you what I'd like you to do. I think that really drives what we've seen, it drives better performance. So for me, it's a good, it's a good asset. I would give it probably a, a 7.6, Seven when it comes to DR, I think it's good. There's slight rooms for improvement. You know, again, paying attention, getting my attention, and the end card. Um, for branding, I'm gonna give it a 6.5. The reason I give it a 6.5, I don't quite think it's a branding asset. It doesn't have that lifestyle that you're really gonna be touching on, but it's, it's good, and I think it's a good asset for, for anyone to run.